circles, radius and diameter. All right, let's talk about the difference between these two things. The radius of a circle goes from the center to an edge halfway across. However, the diameter, which I have highlighted in green, goes the entire way across the circle through the center. Now, here are some things you need to know. Two radiuses, what would they be equal to? Well, let's take a look at this. If I take a radius and another radius, put them together, notice it goes the whole way across. Two radiuses are the same as one diameter. You should also know that half of the diameter or the diameter divided by two is gonna give you something very important here. Let's take a look at this. Here's half of the diameter. And if you notice, it matches the radius. So half of the diameter will give you the radius. All right, let's look at some examples here of circles. What are we given here? Who's the radius? Who's the diameter? Well, 30 inches looks like it's the line segment that goes the entire way across the circle. Now that 30 inches sometimes on problems could be labeled here. Please do not think that that's the dot itself, but it's the line segment going through that dot. And since that line segment goes the whole way across, that is your diameter. What's your radius? Well, the radius is only half as much of a diameter, so that radius would be 15 inches. Now, how about this drawing? Notice the line segment goes from the center to an edge only half of the way across, so that is our radius of seven meters. What about the diameter? The diameter would be twice as long going through the center the entire way across, so twice the value of seven would be a diameter of 14 meters. All right, one more problem. What number would replace the R in the formula for the area of a circle, which you could find on Pennsylvania's formula sheet? A equals pi times radius squared. All right, R is radius. Did they give us the value of the radius? Well, no, they did not. This is the line segment that goes the entire way across the circle. That's not radius. That's diameter. You would have to take that diameter, divide it by two, to get the value of the radius, which would be 23. So the R for radius gets replaced with the actual radius value, half the value of the diameter.